still cheating hard will make you weak. Round three. Report for very low calorie day. Hmm. 15 and 16? I guess. March the 19th. 2011. Hi guys, quick update, or at least we hope it's quick, huh? Ah, uh, got the grandson over here, so we're gonna go to the movies in a little while, see a matinee at the Dollar Theater, no less. I am so cheap. I am so cheap. Not only do we have to go to the Dollar Theater, but we have to go to the matinee too. What? What? I'm not paying those scalpers rates at the real theater. Anyway, um, I don't, I don't have a whole lot for you. What do I have? You saw my scale shots that, um, I'm down. I'm down another pound a day. Yesterday I was down. Who knows? I didn't write it down, but I was down. I think it was 192.4 to 191.6, 6.8 yesterday, one pound today. You guys knew I swelled up the other night. I still have been feeling swollen. Not feeling good. I don't know what the heck is going on. But anyway, I think I'm fixing to start back up on my antibiotics because I'm pretty sure I've got a cootie that's come to hang out with me for a while, but I'm going to kill that sucker. I don't know much. I just watched Chunk's vlog. Chunk, thanks for the shout out, buddy. Um, he got on a little soapbox about people being the protocol police or the propo, as I call them. I guess I've missed that. I don't know how I missed it, but I haven't really seen people being um, critical or knowing, you know, the do it my way, my way is the right way. And there is, you know, we know there's protocol. But you know, it's not our place to tell people how to do their journey. So, like I said, I haven't seen it, but anyway, it, it does end up causing not happy feelings, so there's really no point in doing it. And also, I guess I haven't been checking things as closely as I thought. You know, we've been busy and had the grandkids, so I have, may have missed something. Chunk said something about people thought he was hitting on them. Now, you guys, if you're watching me, if you're any of those people, don't be messing with Chunk. Don't be messing with our Chunk. Chunk's got like hundreds of big sisters that are just like watching his back. We love Chunk. If Chunk's going to mess with anybody, if he's going to, it's going to be me. So, just kidding. Chunk, if your wife's watching this with you, tell her I'm just kidding. And speaking of which, me and Chunk are planning to have a southern cooking throwdown. Uh-huh. Um, I called it P-1000, but he says P-10,000, which means it can only be even better than I could imagine. I'm going to get that boy down here to Arkansas, and I probably ain't going to cook for him because I'm not that good of a cook. But guys, this is totally off protocol. Chunk. I know a restaurant, it's a little bitty old place, dude, they make the best barbecue and fried fish, and the hush puppies will make you want to slap your mama, and they have a plate where you can get all of these things together on one plate, that's right, then we're going to come home and we're going to make fried pies and homemade ice cream. These are going to be great, but we have to get sold first. Hmm. All right, then. We'll do that. So that's all I have to say about that. I also don't know. I'm sure, hopefully, you guys have found them. Um, it's Miss Mickey 99 HCG. Her name's Michelle. And she's an old-timer who took her uh, YouTube account down, but now she's back up. If you're not watching her, look her up because she's, first off, she is so good at sticking to protocol 
and she is so positive, always positive, and builds you up, and she's just a really good one to watch. So, if you don't have her, it's Ms. M.S. Mickey, M-I-C-K-E-Y, 99HCG. I hope you guys realize how hard it was for me not to sing the Mickey Mouse song right then. It's my life. Oh, here comes the grandkid. Come here. Say hello. Hi. Say hi. You have to say hi right there. Hi. Hi. We're going to go see a movie in a minute. Let me finish and I'll be one sec. We made biscuits this morning. We always make homemade biscuits when he comes over. He's my little biscuit maker. So that was fun. What do I know? I think that's really all I know. I'm going to put my numbers. You got my numbers. I'm at 190.6, which is still 0.6 above my freak weight of 190. We still don't know what happened there. I may never know. On that note, I wanted to tell you guys, I'm not real good about keeping up with what I've eaten so that if I have a great day that I can go back and go, oh, this is what I did. Let's try that again. You know, usually I can't remember what I've done about an hour ago. So I had this brilliant idea. I have great ideas. I just don't stay. It's a pity this is so hard for me. See my little note card? Very simple. Very simple. Has the date, what I ate, my weight that morning, and then I put the, on the next morning, I put the next morning's weight on the bottom so I can kind of see what I did. And this is yesterday's card because I just started this yesterday. And so I lost a pound yesterday. And so now I have... You know what? Whatever part of my brain is damaged is the part also that helps with that, besides the memory. I'm going to start studying my brain because they say you can learn to figure out where the damage is so I can work around it. But anyway, this is today's card. And that way I can just keep it in my purse. And then if I eat some, I'll write it down. And I've got it. And then I can look if I have a good day. Then I can look back and go, yeah, that was a great day. I'm going to do that again. That's all I know. We're getting ready to go to the movie. Love you guys. Bye. 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 I can do this. You're cheating hard.